As I pick up the phone, as soon as I hit answer, I hear Sheena crying hysterically. And she said, Nate, I'm sorry. And I threw my phone on the ground, and I knew what Sheena was about to do. And I began crying and grabbing the ground, and my sweet mates, the guys who I was going with them, are sweet. They all came around me, they're like, what's going on? What's up, bro? What's going on? And I could not get it out. I ended up getting back in touch with Sheena, and Sheena told me, Nate, I found your father dead on the floor. She said he slumped over. I'm not sure if he had a heart attack. I'm not sure what happened, but your father's gone. This very moment changed the course of my life. I was emotionally all over the place. You can probably imagine. Me and my father were like this. I talked to him every day. He was my best friend. He was a father. He was a great leader. But emotionally, I was all over the place because I was torn. I'm in school. I'm away. I'm doing things that my parents are proud of. I'm getting my education. But I knew, I knew, I knew I could not continue. 